Hello, and welcome to another fun STEM experiment. So today, you'll need shaving cream, food coloring again. Who do so many experiments use food dye? Um, a spoon and a fork. No, wait, a spoon and a fork, <laughs> printer paper, paper towels, and a pan, and a pan to fit the paper on. We're going to be creating some pretty marbled paper today. All right. Let's begin. Here, we'll do this so you can see it better. All right, so first, using a spoon, spread a thin layer of shaving cream in the bottom of the pan. All you need is a shallow coating. Come on. All right. It's actually kind of fun. <laughs> So make sure to get all those spots. <laughs> do 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 I feel like I'm frosting so up oh, the pan. <laughs> Shaving cream frosting. Maybe a little more. All right, next. Okay, I gotta stop being a perfectionist. It doesn't have to be perfect. It's shaving cream. Next, you're going to dot the surface of the shaving cream with food coloring. I'll just put that right there. Stay. Okay. So we're gonna dot it with food coloring. One, two, three, four, five. I'm doing shaving cream art, do, 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 do. Shave and green art. Oh, let's do some yellow. Cheerful yellow. Eh, it's red or yellow. No, this is definitely yellow. It's just coming out kind of red. Orange. I don't know. Maybe I'm colorblind. All right, and now we'll do some green for a little something to stand out. All righty. All righty, next, you're going to run 
the tines of the fork through the colors in a wavy fashion. Try not swirling your colors or else they will run together. All right, so we're gonna go like this. Oh, that, that's a beautiful sound. That sound is what dreams are made of. A great sound. Like nails on a chalkboard. <laughs> All right. Do, do, do. I'm going to sing, so I don't have to hear the sound too much. All right. Now, what you're going to do is lay your paper on top of the colored, oh, lay your paper on top of the colored layer in the pan. Smooth the paper out over the shaving cream and then wait 30 seconds. All right, let's do that. Moment of truth. Paper. Check. Laying it out on top of the colored pan. Check. All right, wait 30 seconds. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, Mississippi, four Mississippi, five Mississippi, six Mississippi, eight Mississippi, nine Mississippi, ten. All right, so now you're going to remove the paper. Remove the paper. Thanks. I'm making a huge mess. <laughs> Remove the paper and wipe the shave shaving cream off with a dry towel. If you do this carefully, none of your colors will dry or be distorted. This is like the moment of truth. Wipe it. Gosh, I hope I'm doing this right. <laughs> this is nerve wracking. Oh, hey, it's working. Ish, it's working ish. Ooh, it kind of came out cool. Try it again later. All right, you need to allow it to dry. Allow it to dry. Oh, wait. Oh God, shaving cream everywhere. 
That looks pretty cool. And then you have your own pretty marbled paper. Um, you could wrap things with it or use it as origami paper or what have you. And now let's talk a little bit about how it works. In chemistry, absorption is a chemical or physical process where one substance takes in another substance. In this experiment, the shaving cream is absorbing the food coloring and the computer paper then absorbs the colors. And the result is we get multi-colored gift wrap. And that is today's STEM experiment. Oops, 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 there we go. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it and tune in next week for another fun experiment. Bye.